Here are the three in the robot modes. You can see Diatlis is the tallest out of the three. And it comes with this nice shield and gun right there with some radars on the side. And that's his son, the Micromaster. His name is Speeder. Sonic Bomber. He's Micromaster. He's Sonic. Sonic turns into a, a car drill buster. You can see the treads on his arms and feet. A decal sticker that goes on here. So to transform him, bring his arms back and then put his feet up inward like that and then bring his arms back down. It'll snap. Yeah. Now Roadfire transforms into a Cybertronian tank. It has knees could bend there. Um, it could also kick forward. Yeah. If you want his arms to rotate, you go take off his backpack. So now his arm could move like freely 360 degrees. There's like a little white peg in there that makes his arm stops. See, it stops right there. It clicks a little. So that's okay. His head looks nice. He has uh, green eyes there. Uh, I could look upward like that, but can't rotate. Now to transform him, it's pretty easy. Bring his arm forward, put his fist inside. Okay. Then bring his whole upper chest down. Like that. And then it's supposed to snap. So this is the back portion of the tank. Front will be the jetpack. You just insert the pegs into the white inserts there. Like that and it snaps. And then the turret goes up here in that hole. Looks like he has some rocket boosters there, but they're up here. It should have been able to uh, move downward, but I guess they didn't have the sense to make them like that on a toy. It would have been nice if the boosters were back here instead. He has wheels here and two up here. So, now the gimmick is when you press this yellow button, boosters press these buttons up here like that and then it opens the front opens up and then you can put drill buster in there and it shoots out drill buster on the ramp now sonic sonic bombers micromaster transforms into a car we'll just straighten out his side doors, bring the front of the car in, and then I'll snap that, and then his feet inward like that. It looks kind of like G1 Prowl or Silver Streak. It's pretty old for a 1990s car. Sonic Bomber, articulation, his head cannot move up or down or rotate. Now his arm right here could rotate and you can hear like a little gear in there and his arm could push push on the side like that but it cannot bend so and his fist that's all it could do so it looks like he had a blade there and his legs he could do the split um, it could turn 360 on that side this part and he has uh, these extenders so he won't fall back when, when standing. Decent flying pose.
transform him to his jet mode, take off the weapon, bring these up, and then his front jet nose will be turned like that from his arm. And then when you bring this down, his head will automatically go down. And then you connect the arms with that peg there and there's a hole in there. And this gray part will snap into place. So as long as you have everything straightened out, that should snap in okay. Now his feet, bring those back like that till it snaps. And then make him do the split. And then rotate these side uh, wings like that. Okay, last but not least, you open up his chest, and that reveals his wheels here. So that when it go, when you let it roll, uh, it'll be rolling on these wheels and this plastic unmovable wheel, and this one right here. look and there's a hole in there where you could stick his gun what you could also do with his legs is flip these out like that That way he has some weapons on the side of his wings. Now he's ready for war. Okay, to transform into a base, take his weapon out there, and then um, Bring his legs out like this. Press the button back here, and then it'll flip out his ramp. So this tip point is supposed to hit this gray button here, which will spread out his arms like that. Flip this up and then make this nose cone out like that. Same with the other. Turn it 90 degrees, bring this up, and then bring the front nose cone down. Okay, after that, bring his legs up. That. And then you can bring the wheel back out. Now his weapon has a hole up there. So you just flip the weapon backwards. Put it in this peg here. On either leg, 